In this video, I'm gonna show you the best export settings for your TikTok videos using Premiere Pro. Stick around. Tyler here from Video Editing with Tyler White. And if you wanna learn how to edit a video like a pro, start now by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. So once you have Premiere Pro open up, the first thing you do is go up to File, New, Sequence, and then go over to settings and just make sure the editing mode is set to DSLR. And then time base, my time base is set to 23.976 frames per second because I shot my video at 23.976, but you can change yours to whatever you like. It's just whatever your preference is. The next thing that we're gonna change is the aspect ratio. So right now it is currently set to the standard aspect ratio of 16 by nine, which you see in most YouTube videos or movies and stuff like that. We need to change it to the mobile aspect ratio for TikTok. So what that is, is nine by 16. So we're gonna just change that to the 1080, and then we'll change this to 1920. And now you can see it was changed to that vertical aspect ratio of nine by 16. Um, everything else can remain the same, and then you're just gonna go on down and press okay. So first thing I'm gonna do is import my first clip, and this clip is actually shot at the 16 by nine aspect ratio, but that's not really a big deal. Just whenever you drop it down to the timeline, I want you to select keep existing settings for that sequence. Don't change the sequence settings. And then whenever I come down here, as you can see, it's not properly framed. So in order to fix this, all we have to do is just select the clip, go up to the editing tab, and then we're just gonna scale this up a little bit. This is totally fine, you can do this. You just gotta keep this in mind when you're shooting your video, how to properly frame your subject because you wanna still be able to see your subject once you get into Premiere Pro. So just keep in mind that the more you have to scale in, the lower your quality is gonna be, but this is gonna be totally fine for this tutorial. And then I'm gonna go back to the assembly tab and I'm gonna drag my second clip onto the timeline, which is actually already in that nine by 16 aspect ratio. So it's really, really easy. So for the sake of this tutorial, we're gonna say that we've already done all of our editing and now we are ready to export. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go to the very beginning of my timeline. I'm gonna press I on the keyboard for N and then I'm gonna go to the very end of my footage and then I'm gonna press O on the keyboard for out. And this just creates an area that tells Premiere the area that I want to export my video. So then I'm gonna go over here to file, go down to export, media, and then I'm gonna first start off by making sure that my format is already set to H.264. Then my preset, I can just change my preset to high quality 1080p HD. And then output name, I'm just going to name this TikTok. And this is basically where you wanna save your file and what you wanna name it as. So you can save it and name it whatever you want and whatever you want. And then I wanna make sure that I check export video and check export audio. And then I want to make sure that I review my summary section. And as you can see, 1920 by 1080 is not what I want to export at because it's gonna give me that 16 by nine aspect ratio. So in order to change that, I'm just gonna go down here to basic video settings and I'm gonna click on match source. And what that does is it changes it back. And as you can see, it changed it here as well. Changes it back to that nine by 16 aspect ratio. And then I'm gonna go down and check my frame rate, make sure that it's correct. If it's not, just uncheck the box and then change it to whatever frame rate you want to export at. Field order should be set to progressive. Aspect should be set to square pixels 1.0. And then ensure that you check render at maximum depth. I'm then gonna scroll down to the encoding settings and just change performance to software encoding. And then I wanna make the profile, we're gonna uncheck this box and we're gonna change this to high. And then uncheck this and set the level to 4.2. Then we're gonna keep scrolling down. And then we're gonna get down to the actual bitrate settings itself. So all I want you to do is set this to VBR2 pass and then change the target bitrate to 15 and the maximum bitrate to 40. Once you've done that, all you have to do is check use maximum render quality. And then I want you to go up here to where it says preset and then click on this uh, option that says save preset. And then I want you to name this TikTok export settings and then just press okay and what that does is it just created a preset so you don't have to go through this process every single time and then once you've done that all you got to do is press export continue to perfect your skills by checking out this video edit like a pro by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything i'll see you in the next video